All right, guys, I'm in Target right now, and I'm going to show you a few of the things that I like to buy while I'm at Target. So um, they have a lot of organic and healthy stuff, and they're good in Gather brand, or just in general. And I'm going to point a few of those things out because this is one of my favorite places to shop to get healthy food items. All right, we're in the candy section here right now, and I know that that's contrary to healthy, but they do have a lot of healthy stuff in here. These organic coconut minis. I like these. These are really good. Um, also, I like the... Skinny dip almonds, these are great. And the prices are good for these. These are $3.99 and these are $4.99. I've also had these, these are really good. I like these a lot and here they're $4.29 at Shearer and Publix. And then I'm gonna show you some of the chocolate bars that I like to get over here. Um, I like these Justin's chocolate bars because they're organic peanut butter cups and they're non-GMO. Um, they're not inexpensive. They are $6.29, but I'm telling you, after you have these, you'll never go back to eating old peanut butter cups again. If you're watching your sugar, these um, Lulies have no sugar added peanut butter cups on them, and they're really good, and they're a little bit cheaper, but these are really tasty as well, and they're fair trade, which means that um, they don't hurt the rainforest or something. They're organically sourced or, or environmentally friendly sourced. I'm not entirely sure. They don't kill the rainforest while they're, they're getting their chocolate beans and they have bars and stuff that match these and all different flavors i've tried some of these i've tried the milk chocolate one i've tried this one and it's really good so i highly recommend those and while this is not on my healthy list of items this is my favorite thing in this entire store and it's on sale and i'm definitely getting one of these this marzipan or ever how you pronounce this this is like like crap to me i love this stuff it's amazing this is another one of the chocolate bars that i like I like the almonds and sea salt dark chocolate. It's 3 dollars here. I'm going to get one of these. And these are also ethically sourced. Let me see what it says on here. Um, the profits go to save wildlife. And then it does have a normal amount of calories in it. But the ingredients are chocolate, cane sugar, cocoa butter, soy leche, and vanilla, almonds, and sea salt. There's nothing crazy and nasty inside of this. It's composed of one of the other candy bars. This is also something that I buy when I come here are these smart sweets. These are really good. They are like a knockoff of Swedish fish. They don't taste anything like Swedish fish to me. They taste like real fruit. Um, and they're plant-based. They have fiber naturally flavored, free from artificial colors, free from artificial sweeteners. And these are really tasty. But they do not taste like Swedish fish. Like not, not like you would think Swedish fish tastes because Swedish fish are extremely sweet. These are less sweet. They taste more like real berries and real fruit. But I highly recommend these. I have not tried the other ones, but they have other brands. And I'm probably going to grab um, one of the other ones while I'm here because I really like these a lot. So I'm probably going to grab one of these Sour Blast Buddies too to try and give it a shot and I'll let you know how I like these. They even have organic gummy bears. I do get these. I have some of these at home. The price is pretty good. And these are also very tasty and that's a, a recognizable brand. Right, this is one of my favorite things in the store. I get these all the time. They only have six ingredients. Dates, almonds, apples, walnuts, raisins, and cinnamon. And the price is so cheap. These are so tasty. I eat one of these every single day for breakfast. And they have different flavors. So you can get different flavors that you'd like. They even have the many ones. And all these are the generic Laura bars. But Laura bars are, are like expensive and these are really cheap. So I recommend these. This is another one of my favorite things to get here. Al loves these too. We fight over these. Um, I'm out of these, so I'm gonna grab a box myself. But they're not terribly cheap, uh, but there are 36 bars in there, so that's a lot of bars. They are organic. You get 12 strawberry, mango, and wild berry. So I'm gonna pick up these. These are great to stick in your kids' lunches or to stick in my lunch, and I'm gonna take these to work too. What else they have here are organic potato chips. They have both white and the yellow ones, as well as the veggie flavored ones. These are excellent. They taste exactly <laughs> like normal corn chips. They even have blue ones and uh, different kinds of blue ones. Green bag of the those up there, but see, they're like two for five bucks. I don't know about you guys, but we eat a lot of these with salsa, and these particular ones are very tasty and they're organic. So why else would you not want to get these? They're non-GMO. Get these; they're great. They even have organic juice pouches for your kids, and the price is reasonable. It's only negligibly more expensive than the Capri Sun price, like 20 cents more, but they're organic. So I would recommend these. I've tried them. They're very good. So you say your kids like Pop-Tarts for breakfast? Well, they have their own version of Organic Nature's Path here and cherry, wild berry, and berry strawberry. These are really good. It's only $3.99, so they're only about a dollar more than the, the Pop-Tarts bread, and they're good. And I've tried these. I recommend the 
very strong. We granola. also have some organic chocolate coconut granola here for four ninety nine. This is going to be yogurt and stuff. They also have this brand Purely Elizabeth, which is really good, and it's on sale right now for four thirty nine. So these are good prices, and I recommend all of those. Here's some more organic granola flavors from Target, which are on sale for three thirty nine. If you want to try them, they're great on top of yogurt. They also have organic Frosty Flakes and organic Cheerios and organic chocolate Super Loops and organic Berry Super Loops and cinnamon Super Loops that are by Kashi. And then they have these that are by the Good and Gather brand, which is Target's brand. I haven't tried those, but they look great. And I would recommend them because everything I've tried by Good and Gather. I like hot tea. This is my favorite hot tea in the whole planet. So if you're into hot tea, just do it. This hot cinnamon spice tea is amazing. You won't regret it. It is $5.79, but well worth it. One of my favorite sections in Target, it's the spice aisle. All of these spices are organic. And I'm gonna slow down so you can see the prices. Some of them are as cheap as $2 or something. So these are really good prices on organic spices. And my favorite part of it is they have these weird things. Like, what is Zatar seasoning? What is Raz El Anot? I don't know. Duka. I know what Chimchuri is. Honey Sriracha seasoning. All these are organic and the price is $3.99. So these are great. Mommy mushroom. I don't even know what that is. Um, but I tried these, uh, I try to get like a something every time I come, a spice of some kind to try. Um, I think I'm going to get the chimchurri this time because it looks interesting and it's organic. I just picked these up. They are organic dark chocolate chunks and organic semi-sweet chocolate chips for baking. I like to put these in pancakes and stuff like that. You'll see uh, they have organic pancake mix layer, but, um, the prices are good and these are the Good & Gather brand. So I really like these are the pancakes that I buy here, the Birch Blend Organic Classic Pancake Mix. They're very good. Put those chocolate chips in them. They're great. I also have these and I've tried these and they're very good too. And they're on sale right now, but I have some at home, a whole box that I just got. Also, this is the maple syrup. Always buy 100% or maple syrup. If you're not buying maple syrup, I don't know what you're, you're eating corn syrup. Like none of this syrup over here is like real syrup. All of that is just corn syrup colored. This is real stuff. It's thin, it's liquidy. If your syrup is not like that, it's not real maple syrup. And the price here is good. It's like $6.59. You also have organic here is sugar. It's $5.59 and it comes in a resealable pouch. Actually, this one was $3.69 and it's now $2.99. I'm not sure if those are, oh, that's the larger pouch. It's a smaller pouch, so if you want to try it. I just bought a pack of this myself because that's what I'm going to put in my apple cake. And it's $3.29. This is good. They also have organic powdered sugar, and organic coconut palm sugar, organic chia seeds. All the prices are really good. Organic all-purpose flour, which I have at my house, and I use that all the time, and it's only $3.99. They have organic coconut flour. Also, if you're into that kind of thing. I buy a lot of my olds. This is my preferred brand, the chosen brand. So when I see it go on sale, I grab those. That's the avocado oil that I use and the avocado oil spray that I use. The California brand is, the Primal Kitchen brand is good too, but it's more expensive and these are just as good. Also, this is my preferred olive oil brand that they sell here. So I just picked up a bottle of that olive oil. Actually, it's in my car right now. So you can get that here as well. This is where I got my organic sesame oil also. This is one of my favorite macaroni cheese. It's certified organic. It's grass-fed cheese. So this is really good. And it's only $2.79. So please feed your, your kids like good quality food instead of this like, we don't even know what's inside of that. And it's only like $2.79. This is $1.19. It's not much more. It's worth it to get the good stuff. This stuff, like after you taste it, you'll never go back to the other stuff. And if you're vegan, they have vegan ones as well. And they're about the same price as well. And everyone's into is Hamburger Helper. They even have Auntie's Organic Pasta Hamburger Helper with hidden veggies. Like, so if you're going to make your kids Hamburger Helper again, like, it's only $2.99. It's almost the same price as regular Hamburger Helper. It's only, like, twice the price. But, like, this has better quality ingredients in it. And it has veggies mixed in. Like, the, do yourself a favor and get the good stuff. Believe me, after you taste it, you'll understand what I'm talking about. These are really good. The thing that I buy here are the organic beans. They're only 99 cents a can. And they have different ones, kidney beans, chickpeas, cannelli beans, free bean blend, and pinto beans. So like, and they're all only 99 cents. So there's no reason to buy like non-organic and get crap in your food, like pesticides when you can just get these here. Because 99 cents is really- They even have organic rice. This is where I get my rice. I get the organic jasmine, organic basmati. They even have the uh, 
Arborio rice here. And this I buy here as well is the organic quinoa. Um, that's a big bag of it, but they have smaller bags here. Um, that's couscous and rainbow quinoa. All of this stuff is organic through here. Organic whole grain rice melody. And the prices are not like the cheapest in the world, but um, they last for a long time, this stuff does. So it's worth it to me because you're getting the organic and rice is one of those things that eat a lot of and should be organic. So this is where I get this stuff. And you also have here is pizza sauce that's organic. And it's $1.79, it's really cheap and inexpensive. So here's another option for Here's the organic pasta section. They have all kinds of organic sauces you can choose from. These are all really good. I've tried probably all of them because they're good quality. <laughs> they also have organic elbow noodles, organic spaghetti noodles, organic whole wheat for volley noodles. They have orso and um, some other different shaped pastas here. But I highly recommend this. Have organic here are the flour tortillas. These are extremely good. I buy two of these at a time and I put one in the freezer. These are huge. They're 10 inch and they're a really good price. They're 2 dollars and these are very, very tasty. That's what I make my enchiladas and burritos. Tips stuff. are concerned for the dips and stuff. They do have organic salsa here. They are out of the hot, which is what I usually get, but um, they do have the regular one here, but the hot one looks exactly the same. just has a red label, but um, this is really good too and it's only $1.99. We also have a lot of organic dressings here for the $2.79 price for salads, but personally you should get Primal Kitchen. Primal Kitchen is the best quality oil in it. These are all made with real avocado oil. These are made with like cruddy oil in them. So I wouldn't buy those personally because the oil matters and these are the best ones. They do cost more, but salad dressing lasts me forever. So these are great and they do sell with have organic apple cider vinegar, which is something I've never noticed. It's $2.99. This is where I get my organic chicken broth or one of the places that I get my organic chicken broth. Um, I'm actually out of it. So I'm going to get a pack of the low sodium and I'm going to get a pack of the chicken bone broth. I like to have these on hand. All in addition, they also in addition they also have organic vegetable broth and beef broth. So those are something that they have as well as well as chicken broth. This is also where I got my organic tamari sauce. Uh, it's three fifty nine, which is a good price for tamari sauce. They um, have a lot of these Asian sauces that are really good. I buy these a lot when I'm not worrying about organic. These sauces are really good. They're on sale too for five dollars. Um, I put these on a lot of my stir fries. They're really good. You also have tiki masala sauce if you're into that, pad thai, and all those things like that. These sauces all taste very good. I've tried every one of them, so I'm not always into organic, but when I am, I get it here. And I get the, the they also have here the Primal Kitchen um, unsweetened organic barbecue sauce in both the yellow, which is the mustard flavor. I like this one the most and the classic barbecue sauce. So these are very good for barbecuing. Both of those I recommend. They also have their brand, but I don't get these because they have too much sugar in it. I usually get these. Or they're actually out of this G Hughes, which has no sugar added. And this is a good brand here. Obviously they're out of it, but that one's really good. They even have organic ketchup here, which is only $1.89. Um, I buy this at home. I have this in my refrigerator right now. Um, this is at G Hughes, guys. They have the barbecue sauce. They also have sugar-free ketchup here. Everything this dude makes is really good. I like this guy. So anytime you see this brand of stuff, try it. This guy makes good stuff. They even have organic strawberry preserves and Concord jelly fruit spread, Concord grape fruit spread. So they even have organic stuff like that here. There's organic raw honey. I have this in my house right now, so I do get that but there's other kind of fruit spreads and stuff that are organic. If you've never tried this kind of bread, you need to. It comes in all kinds. Um, the rocking grains, um, English muffins. I like, I get the classic ones for breakfast. We have those. I like the boom and berry. They're very good. Um, the raisin the roof is good. And all of these seeded breads are really good and they're healthy for you. And I wish you could smell them because they smell so amazing. Now I've never seen this or tried this. But they have currently Arnold's organic bread right here with 22 grains and seed non-GMO. So that looks really tasty that, and the price is good. So I would try that myself actually. We also have these power waffles that are already pre-made, made out of a Klondike cake mix. Cake mix, I mean waffle mix, you see I want some cake. And they have flapjacks as well. So these are all very good. I actually have them in my <laughs> freezer at home right now. Also, I've never tried the Paleo Birch Benders, but this is the pancake mix that I use, so I'm assuming that they're just as good. Another surprise find that they have in Target are these frozen organic fruit mixes I use. They use for smoothies. In fact, I have a bag of this right here in my freezer right now. And I have a bag of these organic mix berry blend in my freezer right now. I use these for smoothies. And they have smaller bags if you want to get like a smaller one. 
that are organic. Here's some mangoes. Um, they seem to be out of the, the smaller of the, the other mixed berries that are like that. If you don't care about organic, they have cheaper the other ones that huge bags of everything over here. These are great for smoothies. Also, they have these coconut smoothie picks, and these are also organic. These are great for smoothies, bite-sized pieces of watermelon, passion fruit, and they have these sakai stuff to make kai bowls with the granola and stuff and some fresh fruit. It's actually really good. So I have some organic frozen berries here, berries, oh, vegetables here. <laughs> I don't know what I was thinking about. Um, and these are really inexpensive also. I like to keep these like in the freezer in case I run out of fresh veggies. Just to run it. This is the best um, sandwich meat you've ever. This is the only kind that I buy because it is no antibiotics ever and humanely raised. The ham is amazing as well as the turkey and I get those all the time. This is my favorite brand of cheese. I love all of them because they come in that farm saw cut. I know that they're not organic so oops but they do sell organic cheese if you're into that of two different flavors but they need to stop making this cheese taste so good because I will not stop buying it. It is amazing and I just do it. Buy this cheese. Don't eat it out of the bag. Don't, it'll never make it to the food. Here's also some Simply Purdue. If you've got like kids that like snacks, these are organic chicken breast nuggets and chicken breast tenders as well as chicken breast strips down here. They have really big bags of them. They're actually a really good price. They're about the same price as all the other chicken nuggets and organic all right so right now all ground beef is buy one get one half off um and they have organic grass-fed beef so this is happening um uh, they only have one of them so that makes me a little upset but they're buy one get one 20 percent off it makes me a little upset but this one's coming home with me and i'm gonna buy a regular one of some sort to go with it so let's see if they have anything that's acceptable um i probably get these. I wonder if the ground beef that is already shaped like this counts. I don't know. Because that would work great for me. Uh, they have the Boros. I think I'll take this one. No antibiotics, no hormones, whatever. I'll take this one. So that will be my other pack of ground meat because I don't see any other ground meat. I usually don't prefer to have the 96% lean. I usually prefer to be 85 because it's better, it tastes better that way. But we'll try this because they didn't have a second grass fed beef, which makes me sad. But they do have the grass fed organic beef. Do it. Just, just buy the chicken sausage. This is the best Indooli sausage in the planet. I know that it says chicken, but I swear you'll never know that it says chicken. And it's only $3.99. This it is the best Indooli sausage ever. So just buy it. I forgot to mention that this has no nitrates and it's chicken raised without antibodies. So this is good stuff. We also have organic salted butter here, which I'm going to buy one of because I'm almost out of food. We have this farm cooked ground turkey. That is a good price, but um, I don't know what they're for ground turkey, but we need that because we're like we're out of antibiotics. They also have no antibiotics and we're chicken breast center going. It's not organic, but it, the race came free, so that's slightly better than not having organic for all, it's the actual organic chicken that we're going to But as you can see, the price difference is significant. Here's something you don't see every day. Organic cinnamon rolls, and yes, baby, these are coming home with me because I'm going to try that. Organic cinnamon rolls, heck yeah, baby. Let's try these out. I'll let you know how they are. They also have the organic honey crisp apples. These are the kind of apples that I got from my, my box. Look how much just the apples are for a bag. Remember now, I only paid about $40 including shipping and everything for my huge bag of groceries. And um, you only get five apples for them. It costs almost $6 by the time you pay tax. So my box is actually a really good price when you consider how much organic produce. Right is. here are the grass-fed organic milk. Um, I always get the grass-fed organic milk, this one particularly right here. It's $4.99. Always get whole milk because the fat from the milk is actually good for you despite what everybody's been teaching you your whole life. So this is the kind of milk that I want. This is also where I got my white bowls that you see me serve my food in. They also have this gray color. Um, I'm gonna pick up another one of these because they're really hard to find and maybe if I pick this one up, they'll order some more. It's only $5 and they're huge. They are a pasta bowl and it doesn't say how many ounces it is, but they're dishwasher safe. 
So um, I really like this bowl right here. All right, this concludes my shopping experience at Target. I'm going to check out and go home and you guys have a nice evening. I hope you enjoyed the video.